Hey viewers, what is up? I'm Liquid, and of course, y'all been asking for it for a very long time, and I'm doing an update video to some of my classes. I think the last time I did it was a couple months ago, and of course, we still have been figuring out what's been going on with these classes and trying to figure out the best setups. I've actually passed a few of these classes on to some of my viewers in the stream, and of course, they decided that they have worked really well. Some of the guys have been dropping Kims left and right. The past two days, along with some of these classes, I have got over a total of 21 Kims in two days. That's pretty impressive. Um, some games, of course, with double Kims, and I'm a stalker whore, I'll admit it, especially when playing Domination Blitz and a few other game modes that you have to remove really quickly around the map. And it's not like cranked, and you just you know get those, of course, by getting a kill. So... This is my Honey Badger class. Currently, it works really well. Throwing Deadeye on as a main starting perk, it kind of actually gives you a little bit of an advantage. So whenever you have that upper advantage and you have the ability to, I guess, melt faces off, and you also have the ability to start building on the Deadeye. So Deadeye actually will slowly increase. By the time you are on your specialist streaks, you're pretty much getting dead eye hit markers on everything. And you're like, you know, if you see two and three people, they just get completely melted. So Stalker is great. I love moving around, but I did move it into my 10th perk. So of course, I mean, I feel like my starting perks on this class is like the only things you can possibly do. Um, dead Science is a must. Focus is a must. Hardline will help you get all the other things, and Dead Eye is the way I start this. Of course, sleight of hand, depending on how your play style is. I personally like it because it kind of gives me a little bit quicker reload. Even though I'm running extended mags, I do tend to run into multiple targets at a time. So whenever you're running in two, three, four people at a time, it really helps, along with the extended mags. The scavenger, that's a no-brainer. Eventually, you're going to run out of ammo unless you have a friend just dropping you freaking ammo crates every five seconds. Stalker yet again, so I can start moving faster. Ready up and quick draw. That starts getting to where no one can outgun you. Close range, long range, they surprise you, they don't. You know, it doesn't matter. You're basically all around. Um, takedown, I've always loved since like day one because whenever you're on those big streaks, unless they have a headset or unless they're actually paying attention, then they have no clue where you're at. That big X on the screen, you would not be surprised how much that actually helps enemies find you. So especially when you get session joiners like I do. Gambler, well, there was not another one perk that I wanted to use, so therefore I've been using that because once in a while you get sit rep or something like, um, what you call it, a uh, blind eye or something really nice. And of course, ping. Ping is really good whenever you're playing domination and they're all up in a spawn and you're trying to get those last few kills. So that's the main reason I've been using this class. So I've been throwing it on a few others as well and we can scroll down. I actually threw it on my FAD class as well. And I got a double kim with this gun yesterday. I've gotten a double kim with a honey badger with these exact setups. So they really are battle tested. I will say I definitely stand behind these two as being the best class setups as of right now. I do personally like to fad for those games that you need a little bit longer range, but you're also close and you need a big bullet spray. The fad with a dead eye on it basically makes it where people are just getting shredded. I mean, the 51 bullets, whenever you have extended mags on it, it's pretty stupid. And it's just a matter of trying to get those overall, I guess, gun kills. And of course, for the tryhards, and you're not really trying too, too hard, I have the armor pin and, of course, some support streaks. And I feel like if you're not going to have specialists, then sleight of hand, stalker, dead eye, I mean, not dead eye, sorry, um, dead silence, focus, and, of course, scabby is, like, the main needs. I mean, you can, of course, switch scavenger out for... Um, I mean, if you have an ammo crate, you can get, of course, fully loaded or another two perk. It really just depends. And, of course, the Remington Red Dot muzzle brake, that's always, like, a good... That one, of course, I haven't changed yet. And going back to some previous places, I was screwing around with some of these classes. Of course, no joke, you know the M27 is overpowered. I mean, it's just stupid OP. I've been working on a kiss, uh, pistol kim as well since people have been wanting to see those. But I'm actually working also on the SVU. The SVU, that's the class setup right now. I know I've had at least one sniping kim. So I know everybody always likes to see those kind of classes. But overall, that is my main class as least of recent. I've gotten a kim, of course, with the Vepper. I will actually be hosting a video up this week, hopefully, with it. Um, yeah, I've been destroying, like, just dropping Kims left and right, so. And, of course, that's my try hard. You want to tube me, I'll tube you back. Yeah, a lot of people have been tubing lately, and it's kind of starting to get really annoying, so. Um, but overall, that's some, I guess, quick little perks that I use, and definitely check those out if you want to see them a little bit more. 
and try the classes out, of course, because, you know, everyone in my stream keeps asking me, and I just figured the quick video would be a lot of help, and hopefully it did help you out, and hopefully you get some Kims with it. Um, I guess it's about time to go live stream here in a few, and hopefully I'll see you all there. If not, I'll have some more videos coming out this week. I have about five or six, I guess, Kim strikes that I got in stream. Let's see, there's the ARX, the CBJ, the Double Kim Thad, uh, Double Kim on Freight, and a Ripper Strike Zone. So definitely a quite a few gameplays coming for y'all. Make sure you hit that like if you want some more of these kind of videos or any comments, let me know. And I will see y'all next time. Thanks for watching, and y'all have a good day.